Hello everyone and welcome to another Microsoft Excel tutorial. In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to plot a hydrograph and mass curve of rainfall graph using the rainfall data shown in this table here. So let's get started. First things first, the incremental rainfall for a time of 0 minutes should be 0 and therefore the rainfall intensity is equal to 0. So now let us calculate the incremental rainfall in this table using the cumulative rainfall data over here. So we can calculate the incremental rainfall just by keying in this equation d3 minus c3 and hit enter and you can drag it to the right and Excel would have already calculated the incremental rainfall for us already. So the next step is to calculate the rainfall intensity and to do so we can just type in equal sign d4 times 2 and drag it out to the right. The reason why we can multiply the incremental rainfall here by 2 to get the rainfall intensity is because this incremental rainfall is for a 30 minute period so therefore, in one hour, the rainfall intensity should be exactly double of the incremental rainfall. So that's how we can get the value of 12 here, and so on. So now let's move on to plotting our mass curve of rainfall. So we should be in the Insert tab right now, and we should go to the Charts subsection over here. And we should click on the Scatter drop-down over here. For this video, I'll be using the scatter plot with smooth lines and markers here you could also use the option without markers but for this video I'll be using the one with markers here and let's select our data so I'll call the series name as the mass curve of rainfall graph and the x values would be the time in minutes here and the y values would be the cumulative rainfall here and click on OK and click on OK once more and this is the mass curve of rainfall graph here so now I will show you how to plot the Hayato graph so back to the insert tab we should choose the bar graph And let's select the data. So the series name would be Hyatograph. And the series values would be the rainfall intensity in millimeters per hour. And the horizontal axis would be the time in minutes, like so and click on OK once you're done. So as you can see we have our mass curve of rainfall graph here which is essentially the cumulative depth of rainfall against the time in minutes and the Hayato graph over here represents the rainfall intensity in millimeters per hour against the time in minutes like so so that's it for this short Microsoft Excel tutorial. I hope that you learned something new today. If you did learn something new from this video, give it a thumbs up. And do consider subscribing to my channel, it's free. And I hope that you're safe in these unprecedented times. Keep learning and goodbye.